All right, earlier this week, we told you why so many schools are cutting back recess time. Now, you may have seen the story on 11alive.com. Governor Kemp vetoing the bill that would have required a recess from kindergarten to fifth grade, saying it was about not taking away local control. Well, this morning, we're going behind that headline. Christy Etheridge discovering one school that's come up with a very creative way to combine physical activity and schoolwork at the same time with an interactive playground. Welcome to Brumby Elementary, 11. where PE looks more like a disco party. 17. It's essentially a giant touchscreen video game, like a big iPad on the wall. The big items up there that we call the boats, they're filled with lights and speakers and they dance. And if we turn on music in here, the lights will coordinate with the music to set a party. But it's not all fun and games. Well, it is, but it's also a way to get kids moving and do math. Nine minus two. Um, they like the, the uh, whack game, which is the bunny game over there, where they're hitting different targets. We can do colors and shapes and math. We can do numbers. Um, they enjoy that. They enjoy the puzzle game a lot. Those are probably their two favorite. Stephen Cosgrove, PE teacher at Brumby. And there's a lot of research that shows that um, physical activity, increasing the brain activity, it makes it better for students to learn and gets that learning a little easier. The kids work together and burn off a little energy. Woohoo, go team! After a minute or two of playing, these kids are winded, they're out of breath, they're running hard, they're sweating, which is what kids need to be doing more and more of. Cosgrove says eventually they'll use this beyond PE, and teachers can come schedule time, maybe as a reward or instead of a worksheet. There's some dancing games on there we can do as well. So it, it, it sets an atmosphere that's fun and exciting for the kids too. Cosgrove says that it's also good for rainy days or when days when it's just too hot to play outside. Someone saw it on Facebook a couple years ago. The principal gave the green light. Now, thanks to some Title I funding and some extra donations, they were able to install it in a few weeks before school let out. Now, we want to see those back to school photos. Send them to us. Use that hashtag MorningRushATL or on the Morning Rush Insider Facebook group. I have a feeling y'all are going to seriously respond to this <laughs> yeah. one. All right, Francesca, <laughs> over to you.